I want to see the Alliance map. What awaits in Jorvikshire? Halfdan Ragnarsson, Conqueror of the North, sends his greeting. He wishes to meet with Eivor Wolfkist personally. Halfdan Jarl. I've heard that man's name so often, I feel as though I know him already. He is currently entangled in a war with the Picts of the Northern Hills. I suspect he wants your counsel, or your axe. If you are keen to meet him, he asks that you join him at his war camp. I have the location here. I will go at once. With caution, Eivor. Jervikshire is currently at war with the Picts, a proud clan that lives just beyond the Roman Wall. Battle climbed into the hills. Survey the area, Sudan. Eivor Ravenfren. Now there's a face I've seen before. Faravid. We met in Jorvik, the Yuletide Feast. The Yuletide Massacre. I remember. What brings you here? Halfdan Jarl. He summoned me. Is he near? He was, but the Picts hit us hard. We were separated. Fresh attack from the hills. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Picts. They won't be happy to see the likes of me. Odin, take you all!
Are you wounded? I'll live. If we die today, tonight we drink with Odin. Either way we claim victory! Once again. I've done Ragnarsson. We met in the forge of battle. Surely a good sign. I don't know you. One of Farrowit's new dogs? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor, yes. Down in Mercia. Kingmaker with my brothers Ivar and Uba and Finir in East Anglia. From the tales I hear, I feared you might be taller. That's not a fear you feel often, I imagine. So you answered my summons. <laughs> but the timing is poor, as you can see. Too many here are spent, battle saw. Thirsty. Faravid, have your men build field pyres for the dead. At once, my yard. Not here, not now. Then to Donna Castor for a victory feast! The oldest son of Ragnar Lothbrook, so he says. What do you make of him? Heroic display. He makes a powerful first impression. Just the way he likes it. Welcome to Jorvikshire, friend. Well met, Faravid. I was hoping your Jarl would be as welcoming, but I suppose I must earn his trust. Is that why you've come here? To earn Hafton's trust? To find a seat at his table? I have my own table. What I want is a bond of friendship between the new lords of England. Among whom you count yourself, I suppose? It is an ally I seek, not a master. Well, there is but one lord of Northumbria. Roman giants outdid themselves with this fortress. Hey! Where would Hafton Jarl hold court? The 
wash them in spring. No sooner. That is the plan. Yet my people suffer day by day. Your people? Do you rule the Shadow Kingdom under my nose? Our people suffer from these brutal winter raids. This war must end. That is my first concern. The time to strike is... is... when I say we strike. Halfdan's hammer protects this land. Tell my people that, King Rishia. As you wish, my lord. Who is this? Come closer. Havdan Ragnarsson. My sword arm answers your call. Thank you for your tribute, Eivor Wolfkist. Your battles and deeds are well known to me. And you are the hero of Jorvik. So sing my scalds. Not just any hero. Eivor brought order to the city when King Rishie could not. They say you rooted out a gang of thieves and traitors. Not alone. But I led the charge. The silver Eivor recovered there now pays for our war with the Picts. It is wasted fighting Picts. Should be put to better use. I try never to regret the decisions I make in a time of war. Agreed. To second guess ourselves would only stall the victory. I don't regret sending Ferovid to lead our strike against the Picts, in spite of Eivor winning the day. Eivor and I felled them, Haftanjarl, so you could sweep in, stab a few cold corpses, and claim a glorious victory. <laughs> Old friend, your jests hit like Odin's spear, always on the mark. I would not be here without your hammer, Greyjarl. Please accept this, your share of the loot we want today. A thing of beauty. Hmm. Frankish, I believe. What do you think, Eivor? A fine piece of work. Fit for the lips of a king. Or a man who makes kings. There's wisdom in this one, Faravid. By your leave, Lord, I must return to my forward camp. It's a long, cold ride. Two-faced, smirking glory hound. My lord, in your summons you said... Shh. Not here. Not now. Dance, sing, and fill yourself with ale. Then meet me atop this tower of stone. There I will weave a tale of friendship and treachery. A tale as old as the world. After me next. Please, Lady Moira. Are you a nun? I thought nuns dressed like geese. Nothing of the sort. I am Moira of Weka, Hafton's herbalist. He is an ill man, and I do what I can to give succor and hope. I saw him fight. He was in fine health then. Thanks in part to my soothing tonics. Would you pardon me? Please, Lady Moira. My wife grows ill. I will attend to her soon, I promise. But Hafton needs me now. Drink good, Fair warning, Chell. My fists have hammered nails and strangled sharks. Still care to brawl? Swift and strong you may be. It's the one most righteous who wins the fight. Come now. Bury us, you should drink good, honestly. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs>
fought well, warrior. But here your legend ends, bound to no name. My luck overspills like the ocean's tide. Only fate will keep me from winning. Then come and see. What fate do these dice hold for you? Conquered this, he and I, together. You have earned great fame, won many battles across England. But not alone, no, no. Bjorn Ironside, fearless Uber, Ivar the Boneless, Sacred Snake and I, great warriors all, my brothers. Gold is good, and battle better, but glory never dies. Forever it lives in the Hall of Heroes, high on Valor's steed. Together we have conquered. Together with my friends, my clan. Faravid, above all others. One sword is not an army, Eivor. Even a hero needs loyal friends. I have never lost sight of that. Never. Have you room for one more among those you call friend? What does friendship mean to you, Eivor? Friendship goes beyond words. It is a solemn bond, a chain unbroken. Spoken like the Faller, it is indeed a kind of magic. You wriggle like an eel in a basket, Hafton. What has caught you? Friendship can also spoil, like rotten meat. After all these years, he dares to bite my hand. Faravid, he seems a good and loyal man. Seems, yes. As a bright sky in winter seems warm. But rumors fly of little men plotting treason in the dark. Have you proof of his treachery? Not yet. That is where you enter my saga. Prove this for me. Discover if Faravid has been disloyal. Then we shall talk of oaths. Start me somewhere. Give me something to go on. You see this? From a sea unicorn. I filter my mead and wine with it. I've heard of such beasts. They swim below the ice, beyond the world's edge. And their horns protect against poison. You believe Faravid wants to poison you? I fear he has tried. Countless times. And failed them all. You don't believe me, but I know the man. His gifts of wine, his easy smile, his envy, his plots. Learn the truth. Dig up... <coughs> An earth is tree. Such a task. Jorvik, you stop the ill deeds of Auden and his swarm of rats. We can do the same here. 
Like a good sword, honor has two edges. I'll help you. Faravid has left the feast already, heading for his camp upriver. Join his warband, and behind his back, dig. And if I find nothing, if he's a good and loyal man, Even better. Even better. Fair enough. I'll find what I find, then return, my friend. Don't let Farrowit fool you. He is hiding something. Go, Zulin. That must be fat of its camp ahead. Cold and dirty must be the place. Throw yourself in Gunungagap, you bastard! I am not a dog! Yet here you are, barking again. Faravid! Ah, oh, Eivor, my friend. Is Donacaster hospitality to your liking? I would be careful calling this one friend, Faravid. The crow who comes flapping when Haftan gives a whistle. Haftan and I spoke, and what of it? This is our fight, our chance for glory. Fly on home, Crow. Lend me a knife, Faravid. This whelp needs gelding. Ofer, piss off.
small men always talk big. So, was Hafton generous? Did you get what you came for? If I help with your fight against the Picts, Hafton will consider me a friend. So point the way, Fadavid. The Picts raided that monastery, plundered its silver and gold. The Saxons built more churches than barns and filled them with herds of monks. Yes, monasteries make tempting targets. And not just for us, we tracked Pictish raiders heading north. I know the place. My raiders sacked Elmet not long ago. Ma. And then they picked the bones left over from your feast. I'm ready to fight. Let's put them in the ground. Halfdan didn't send you north to fight a skirmish we could win with half our numbers. Why are you here, Eivor? You question my word. You never gave it. Then I give you my word, Faravid. I am here to fight Picts. To your arms, dogs! Let's roast some Picts! Yeah! Watch for ambushes. Should have stayed in Doracastri. More mead, fewer Picts. There's no glory in guard duty. Move out! The Picts are just ahead. Lead the way and we'll watch your back. <laughs> Picked up our trail. Hold on. are a sneaky lot, masters of guile and ambush. Have a cue. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Run forward! Faster! Faster! Picked up our trail. Hold on. Picked up our trail. Hold on.
thanked Thor we made it. That... This cave is a passage. The Picts are using it to cross the mountain. A gift for us. You track them through the cave. We'll circle around back and snare any who try to slip away. Hold on. Says should be home filling my belly, not mucking about on the wrong side of the wall. Ah, boil your head. We'll gang forth with our friends soon, and then we'll all eat like kings. Heed my words. Wrong side of the wall. this winter with help from an unknown quarter. The Picts spoke of Stenway, their camp. That's to the north. Their chief may be there. Danes, run! Stop them before they reach Stenway! They spotted us! Run forward! Run! Faster! The heat has found us!
Don't let them get inside! Stop them! Hold on. South of the wall. Don't like it. The Picts don't raid often during... The Picts will be on guard. Have a care. The Hornets have led us to their nest. More than a chief up there. Looks like the forward camp of an army. But would the Picts dare attack in winter? Hafton thinks not. And the Picts may use that to their advantage. Let's find out. Done for now! Why would the Picts make war in winter? They must have a reason, something to gain. Hey, pick them up. Hold on. Now, to hunt down the Pict. Pick up our trail. Hold on. In step with me! Up our trail. Hold on. Trail. Hold on. Huh? <laughs> 
picked up our trail. Hold on. Picked up our trail. Hold on. There's the chief. Now to strike him down. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Have you come to join your fallen? You're on the wrong side of the giant's wall, friend. Have you come to make war in winter? <laughs> Fool! He might have talked! We got what we came for. Is that more Frankish wine? I'll take a few casks. And that silver there. Ofer, that's Hafton's share. Eivor, just in time to divide the spoils. Take some meat, if you like. The Picts had Magnus. This map spells it out. Ah, the wolf kissed is a reader. That stark Seder I'll never mess with. Worry about the Picts later. Now's the time for treasure and spoils. You earned it. It should be ours. We did the work. All of it. And nothing for half done. Warming his cock in a Saxon castle. Open that cask and we'll have a taste. We'll celebrate together. Sorry, friend, but that's Hafton's take. You understand. You won't notice one missing cask. So unless there's something wrong with it, let's have a taste. There's nothing wrong with it, friend. If you insist, we'll all drink some stinking wine. A little sour, but not bad. I've always preferred ale myself, or spiced mead. What I won't drink is one of Moira's herbal brews. She claims they're a tonic, but there's no telling what she hides in those drinks. Moira? I met her at the feast. She's a herbalist from the north, always skulking in the shadows of Hafton's throne. It's a big throne. Don't you all skulk around it from time to time? Why all these doubts, Eivor? You're a warrior, not a rumor monger. Doubt is too strong a word. But there is a feeling of mistrust among you. I want this alliance to be ironclad. 
Then let me change your mind. I've got a plan to win this war for good before the winter sets in. Magnus is a strong fort, but we'd be attacking from the south. With speed, we'll catch them off guard. With Halfton's blessing, I'd fight beside you anywhere. Name the time and place. No, Halfton is done fighting for the winter. He thinks it too great a risk, but I say we can win this war before the next snow. If we tell him of this plan, he'll refuse, but if we succeed, you and I together, he'll sing our praises all the louder. All right, we fight. And I swear by Sif's blade, I'll say nothing to Hafton. Good. Good. Victory is ours. I must return to Danacastra for a time. But I will join you for this battle. Deliver this goblet to my Jarl. He has a fondness for them. And tell him his share of the spoils is coming. When you're ready, find me near Jorvik at a place called the Walds. Shrinks up to each victory. Like